Good, good, good. All right, you too. That's how it's supposed to be when you're at the gate. You don't have to freaking talk if you're a gate guard. Just check the ID, make sure everything's safe, and let the soldier in. God damn. Yeah, that guy took forever talking to that person up front. What is happening, guys? Art Chisel here. Today is the 29th of June, 2016 the day before my birthday and two days before Flor gets back here with Liliana and the new dog Nikki. As of right now, I'm about to go to CQ, that's why I'm up really early and I'm, and I'm not in my PTs. I'm basically just chilling, I already got my ACUs halfway. We're, we're gonna be wearing our ACUs also today because it's kind of raining outside and it's pretty muddy going to the barracks and I don't want to mess up the new uniform so we're wearing the ACUs. So right now I'm just chilling here checking my clan out. I don't know. The room is a mess. I don't know if you can even see that. Yeah, I got a pile of stuff over there. <sighs> After my CQ shift tomorrow for my birthday, I think I'm going to clean the house top to bottom so Blood doesn't get mad at me. You know how it is. If you've been alone in the house for a long time and if you have a wife and you live with someone, when they come back from a long vacation or long trip or whatever, you want the house clean. So what? Oh, I got an alarm. See? I, I woke up even before my alarm. Alarm. Okay. And I think another alarm is going off downstairs for my phone. Yeah, so I guess we'll turn that off and we're gonna eat breakfast, okay? Yep, I am awake before my alarm and I'm already in my uniform halfway. So I do wake up really early, so let's turn that off. Alarm off. Sub Drake, how are you doing? Let's turn on the lights. Bam, as you can see, the house is also a mess. Hopefully it's not too dark. But the goal is, I don't know if you know this, but I had a video of Drake all by himself. Not all by himself, but with the other dog, Nikki, when they were just chilling. I left them basically at home because I had to go pick up Flor and Iliana. I think I titled it, What Dogs Do When You're Not Home. See you in a bit, Drakey, Nikki. For today... I think I'm going to set up my camera so Drake can do whatever he wants, but I have to film him. Can't use the GoPro because I'm going to have to take it for my vlog, but I'll use the tripod and the other camera. So let's see what Drake does. We'll do that and we'll insert it into the vlog. Drake, behave. If you pee in the house or poop in the house, we're going to get it in the camera, okay? He's been a good boy. Yeah, he's so excited to see Nikki again. His sister, their siblings. Right, Drake? So I got my rucksack left out there, I got a little doggy cage, Juliana's little tent in her play area. I probably need to vacuum. It kind of stinks actually. I think Drake peed inside somehow. Huh. Wanna play a little bit before I go? Well, it's still too early, but go get it! Good boy! Good boy, Drake. Okay, pull. I'm gonna let go, okay? Oh, good job. Hey, give it back to me. No, no, give it back to me. Oh, oh. There you go, got it. Go! Good boy, good boy. He's a really good boy. Good boy, Drake. Yeah, I know a lot of you guys have been asking also, like, what dogs are allowed on post. Every post is kind of different, but most of them follow a general guideline. But I did make a video about that. So if you search my channel for army pet policy in my channel you'll see a video for that it's kind of like old but it basically summarizes what is allowed and what what's not allowed on fort hood this guy's really having fun with it you like your toy can i have it i don't know why is it made like this it's like weird so we got the setup ready tripod and camera is going to be here Focusing somehow somewhere because Drake likes hanging out on that part of the couch Which is the one with the blanket as you can see he's already getting in front of the camera, but we'll turn that on Before we leave I think I got like an hour and a half maybe to two hours of juice on this one Plus the memory card is pretty big so we can get as much footage as we can ACUs is right here. We're gonna use the ACUs right now a lot of people have been asking whenever I upload like a comedy video the one with the purple border, I always use my old, not my old name tape, but Flora's name tape. 
this is my last name. Flor's last name is Montoya. And I use that because when I make comedy sketches, like something just, just, uh, just to goof around, something for comedic purposes, I don't like using my own name. I mean, it's pretty much out there. Like my channel is all about the military and the army. And this is my name. This is my rank, my unit, whatever. But I just don't feel comfortable using my actual last name in those comedy videos because people might take it the other way and it has happened so many times so if you guys are asking Montoya is Flor's maiden name when she was in the army and now she's married to me that's this is that's why this is her last name now and Drake is stepping all over my uniform before we eat breakfast check this out I forgot I had this thing it's like, like a little screwdriver a little knife over there pliers whatever whatnot it's really useful if you know what a Gerber is or if you use one Give this video a thumbs up. If you know what a Gerber is or you've used one, comment down below. Maybe give it a like too. All right, so we're finally back. I got special K milk for my breakfast. And I guess since we're here, let's talk about the CQ shift. CQ shift is a 24 hour duty, usually an NCO and a runner, a soldier, E4 and below. You basically man the CQ desk and be in charge of the whole barracks, make sure nothing crappy or nothing crazy happens. You're an extension of your commanders and first sergeants and your whole chain of command. You have authority in those barracks. You gotta maintain it clean, keep peace, nothing crazy shit going on. Basically, that's the bottom line. And once you're done with the 24-hour shift, the next day you're off for the whole day and you just have to report the following day. But if your day off falls on a Saturday or a non-working day, holiday, whatever it is, I'm sorry, but that's how it is. Some units though, it depends. They'll give you comp day, but I think that's not really unless it's something that's really urgent that you need to take off that day. Well, mine falls on a Wednesday today, and then Thursday is a working day, so I have off on Thursday. But Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Monday is 4th of July weekend. That means I'm technically kind of having like a five-day weekend, which is pretty awesome. And my birthday's tomorrow anyway, so I think it just... It just fits. It's just really good. Can't complain. And with that said, since 4th of July is coming, Enjoy, have fun, watch the fireworks, but be safe out there. Remember, there's a lot of people out there that wants to cause chaos and terror and shit. Be careful, be on the watch. Usually it's like functions or like events that are really big like that where the enemy can strike, you know, crazy shit might happen. Just warning you guys, be on the lookout, okay? Now let me just eat my cereal. The next time you'll see me, we'll be probably in the barracks. Okay, right now we are on the second floor. I'm here in the barracks right now, NCO's barracks. So I'm basically just doing my checks. This floor is pretty much empty. I think there's only one person that lives here. So what I'm doing right now is just making sure everything's clean. Maybe sometime today, tell the soldiers that live here to start mopping and sweeping and all that. Uh, the rooms here in Fort Hood, or these barracks right here, they're not really assigned to anyone yet because there's no name, name tapes or name tags on the doors. You need a card to open that one, a card key. There's two men per room. We can't really give you a tour of the barracks inside the rooms because it's their privacy. I can't do that. Try to ask someone just for a video, but I don't think anyone's going to say yes. But yeah. So this is my desk. It's pretty dark barely anyone here and this is the 5094 that I'm talking about it's basically a log sheet it's a daily staff journal or duty officers log see so you got the time the address and all the information in and out what happened action taken initials and at the end of the day we sign it we turn it in to higher up which is staff duty it's just a log sheet that's pretty much it but you got to read the SOP book as well for the rules and regulations that's supposed to be done as CQ and assistant CQ. Got some lockers over there to hide my bag or secure my bag. Got a lamp over there. I don't know why that's there. Got a DSN phone. And just me. Today's a work week. My shift is a work day. So it shouldn't be that crazy. But if you want to know what happens on the weekend in the barracks, I made a parody comedy skit video about it on my channel about a few days ago, so that just check it out. So for now, I guess I'm gonna read the nice little SOP book. I know fun times, it's probably too dark also, I apologize. 
and I'll see you guys in a bit when I go home and set Drake outside and see what he did in the camera or whatever because he needs to poop and piss outside. Hopefully he doesn't do it inside of the house and if he does, we'll get it on camera. Alright? Because I know you were there for a short time with them, Yeah. Right? I think only two of them finished SSD1. No, when I was there, no one. One went to the Soldier of the Month Bordeaux, Figueroa. Did uh, she win? She did. Uh, one, you know I mean? yeah, one soldier went to a uh, air assault course, but he failed during the course. Sanders. Yeah, it was yeah Sanders. Yeah, he went, but he failed. I think he failed. Uh, he did good on the you know the obstacle, but one of the testing, I forgot what it was. I think sling load. Okay, yeah, the sling load phase. Yeah, well, Sanders got a 270 because uh, yeah, he he had to go to school for that for um, air assault. Okay, so that's your table A. Do you serve as a table A instructor? Yes. Yeah, that's just for a Sarah's time training when we set up uh, like an eight section and we just pulled out stuff. It was like part of Sarah's time training. We pulled out, we set up the ER, you know, where beds go, the the carts on the side. Coming along. Okay. Okay. All right. Thank you. All Appreciate right. it. All right, sir. Okay. All right. So that conversation right there was basically me and my supervisor talking about my NCOER because again I'm about to leave, hint hint again, I think I mentioned that in the last video already and he's about to leave also. So they got to close up my NCOER, we'll talk more about that in a future video but it's basically a report card or an evaluation for NCOs and officers. Officers get an OER, NCOs gets NCOER. So we'll talk about more about that if you do want to learn more about it. Yeah, so we're out here. I think I'm going to get Little Caesars. Then we head back home so we can set Drake free and poop and pee outside. Okay, yes. So I am on lunch break for my CQ. And as of right now, I finally got the pizzas and cheese bread. So I'm just prepping everything before we head back over there. Safety first. Just a little look. Got the cheese bread. I got the pizza over here. The reason why I got pizzas and cheese breads is that so I don't have to cook tomorrow once I get off and floor is basically gonna be back the next day of my recovery the first and on my recovery day I gotta clean I gotta clean a lot I'm, this is getting serious now she's coming back I don't want the drill sergeant to get mad or to yell at me so hopefully you guys understand That's how it's supposed to be when you're at the gate. You don't have to freaking talk if you're a gate guard. Just check the ID, make sure everything's safe, and let the soldier in. God damn. Yeah, that guy took forever talking to that person up front. But it don't matter. I'm just bitching. Deep dish. Little Caesar's pizza. Breadsticks. Cheesy bread. Pizza. Drake, I'm sorry. You gotta go out. Come on. Okay, go do your thing, man. Well, he's a good boy. Camera's dead, obviously. Well, no signs of crazy peas or poop. Actually, it doesn't really smell that bad. I guess I'm just daydreaming earlier. But yeah, I'm gonna go eat because I'm really hungry. Oh my god, it does look amazing. This is gonna be my food for the next day and a half until Flor gets back and just some plain old water. Also, I've been wondering, um, I've been getting a lot of messages from a lot of you guys from the Facebook account, from the Instagram account, and even here on YouTube. Apparently, there's quite a few of you that's actually located near Killeen Fort Hood area and wants to work out with me or some some meet and greet and you know just give some tips advices and just to hang out basically so if you are close to Killeen or you are basically in Killeen area let me know hit me up and we'll set up an appointment date not really an appointment date but 
a date, you know, just to hang out, work out, and maybe just do something. Just let me know. Leave it in the comments down below. Remember that phone conversation that I had when I was in the car? When I was about to go to um, freaking Little Caesars? Yeah, that was my boss asking for a lot more stuff. And um, as of right now, I'm only not even halfway of my CQ ship. I'm actually just on lunch. I'm going to be back there in a bit. And just letting my dog, Drake, get out and do his thing. And with that said, I think today is going to be busy because I have to go back and forth from my CQ desk back to the office to fill out some forms, turn in some memos and stuff like that. So, I appreciate you guys watching. I'm going to cut this vlog a little short, but there's more to come, especially because Flor is back. I'm really excited. Yeah, go drink that water, Drake. He's thirsty. But yeah, that's it for today. Make sure you subscribe so you get notified whenever I upload a new video. Give this video a thumbs up if you like it. And if you don't, just rate it still. Just do, just do it. So show me the links down below. That is it for today. Art Chisel out. It's going to be a long day tomorrow. Yeah, so I don't even know when this is going to be up. But it'll be up when it's up. Alright, thanks guys.